teen shot dead while waiting to sell iPhone 8. Viewers and subscribers, welcome back to my channel once again, people. Much love and appreciation as usual. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button right now, people. It will be greatly appreciated. So news coming out of Trinidad and Tobago, people, is that one of two friends who went to Arima to sell an iPhone was shot and killed after they both were robbed of their valuables. Police have identified the deceased as 19-year-old Nicholas Butcher. According to police reports, on Sunday night, Butcher and his friend were in a white Nissan Wing Road vehicle on the Mario Road in Arima, waiting the arrival of the potential buyer. When they were approached by a gunman, the man reportedly announced a holdup and robbed the two of their cash and other valuables, including the iPhone. Reports are he then shot them both before fleeing the scene. Jaja people, very, very sad and unfortunate situations. I always tell teenagers and young people that whenever you're going to sell an item, please do it in a area that's well lit close to a police station or or something people isn't me i say like if it's a legal iphone if you never thief the product and you're doing an honest sale just go to the nearest place that is you know you feel safe you can't just go at any and any place because nowadays the same potential buyer it's probably the one that set them up to get robbed. All my do I hire somebody, pay somebody, such and such, and boom, look at that. Them shot the two teenagers, them killing one of them people. So it's a very, very sad um, situation to report out of Trinidad people. A teenager um, shot and killed just trying to sell an iPhone. Just trying to sell an iPhone, people. Like one person in the comment section said, this breaks my heart the young man reminds me so much of my son lord have mercy i can only imagine what his parents are going through right now i pray that justice be done and that god almighty gives the family the strength and courage that they would need at this time another person in the comment section said why is it that people keep going to arima to sell their items can't you see all what's happening last year two mechanic was both ambushed i think one is dead and one survived come on people be more vigilant and she's correct you have to be more vigilant in these times people it's not like back then you know where you know say it would be an honest seal people nowadays they are evil and they are cruel they're no business them life no value nothing so for them shoot and kill somebody that is like nothing to them you see me people so be vigilant nowadays um condolences goes out to this young man's family and friends you see me people um, if i get more information i will update you guys on this all right bless up in yourself much love from yard and abroad tv bless up people